Hello folks and welcome to another edition of Intercept U, our ongoing discussion uh, with various individuals that have some background with SIPs or this construction industry and we appreciate you joining us today and, and looking over this video. Something we would like to mention to everyone is uh, as you're watching these and if, if, you, if you see some value in them, and we sure hope you do, uh, subscribe, uh, like, comment on the videos. In the comment sections, put any stories that you have to tell or any questions that you have. We do go back. We check our comments. Uh, we, we try very hard to respond to all of those. So uh, get, it, get involved and tell us what you'd like uh, answered in the future or what topics you'd like discussed that would be valuable to you. Today, what we are uh, going to do for starters is interview uh, one of our regional sales managers, Aaron Hind, he lives uh, out east. Maybe we'll tell him, have him ask or explain to us where he lives and a little bit of your background with the the SIP industry, the construction industry. Uh, what what brings you here? All right. Well, good morning, John. I appreciate the introduction. Um, as John mentioned, my name is Aaron Hind. I live in Southeast Michigan <clears throat> and been in the SIP industry for 28 plus years. Um, installing and also selling the product and just have been around it for a long, long time. Um, a big background in installing it um, as well as selling the product. So it's been, it's been great. And it's a product that I love working with on a daily basis. What, what brought you to the construction industry in the first place? I'm um, actually been in construction ever since uh, I was in high school, just, you know, doing odd jobs or, if I wasn't working on grandpa's farm, I was out doing something. So always just like to um, put things together and then see how the process goes. And it's, it's great to take a piece of bare land and see a beautiful home go up in six months to a year later. Very cool. So it's interesting to me, those of us who kind of grew up in construction and then morphed into sales, uh, we're picky about what we sell we can't sell something that we don't believe in. So what made you comfortable to make that transition and actually start recommending this and, and helping other people through the process of structural insulated panels? Well, that's a great point, John. It's uh, you always align yourself with products you believe in. So, you know, when you're, you, when I came across SIPs, you know, and got into working with SIPs, it's like, it's just a phenomenal project product. It's, it's something that it's, it's more straight. It's more true. Um, it's more stable. You know, we get, you, you break into a bunk of lumber nowadays and, you know, you wait a couple hours and it looks like pretzels out on the, on the field. So it's, it's a product that, you know, once it goes up and if it does sit on, you know, every project has job site delays, but how it looks when it comes off the truck and how it looks in, you know, 40, 50 years is identical. You know, you don't have that movement that you get in some of the standard construction materials, you know, it's just a great product. And then not to mention the, the speed of construction, also the energy efficiency of it. Um, it's also a product that you don't have to have a full 30 yard roll off sitting on the job site when you're building as well. So, you know, you take all those things into account, you know, it goes off faster. It's, it's more true. It's a straighter, more reliable product. And then also the availability to save on job site waste. It's, it's just, you can't, there's so many benefits and features to it. It's, it's interesting. Your, your story sounds so similar to mine. Uh, one of the things that me and my crew all commented on is it brought fun back to building. <laughs> Instead of fighting, oh. it, it, all of a sudden it was fun to build uh, these structures because of, of the very features that you talked about. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's it's just something, you know, like, you know, with SIPs, you know, you get your your product out there and, you know, you go to install your windows and it's just like the RO, the rough opening is exactly if it calls out for a three by five window, it, it goes in perfect. You don't have to adjust that lumber and the header's not sagging. It's just a true window RO to make you know, the process so much easier to install all the products that come after SIPs, you know, your drywall, you've got a nice, simple, smooth, straight surface. So it's, your drywalling goes up a lot quicker. Your siding, it's a nice, straight, true product after it's all installed. Yeah, yeah. very nice. Appreciate that. Uh, that that brings some of that enthusiasm and excitement about structural insulated panels uh, to the to the fore today, which we appreciate. I think our customers and, and industry 
individuals who are investigating this and trying to figure out the differences will appreciate that very much. So we thank you. We look forward to getting to know you better as our discussions go on. Great. Sounds good.